So I'm Erin, this is Jeremiah. We own our own business together. Uh, it's an online sports and outdoors store called Flying Kiwi Outdoors. Pretty much any sport that we like to do, we like to carry equipment for. I'm also a budding author, so I've started writing my own books and um, all of this, we can work from home and maybe from the road would be ideal. <laughs> The thing that actually catapulted us into RV ownership was when we decided to make that move to Oregon. We were living in North Carolina at the time, and we've got two big dogs. We mm. weren't really comfortable putting them in uh, underneath the plane or anything. Nope. We wanted the, the freedom <laughs> to travel across the, the country at our own leisure, at our own speed, and know where our kitchen was going to be and our bed was going to be. And mm -hmm. um, it made it a lot easier. Um, and of course, we want to have adventures too. What we found though when we were going across the country is camper life. We loved it. We just, you know, we got it got us here, but also River has taken us all over the place. We recently went to Canada and we brought the dogs with us and we went to Banff, Canada and Jasper and we just had a wonderful time. But we found that our favorite spots are always the ones that are off grid. Just open the door and there are the woods. Or you open the door, there's the beach. We would really like the ability to boondock for multiple days rather than having to go find shore power every two or three days. What solar is going to do for us is it's going to let us go for weeks at a time, bring our work with us, bring our dogs with us, and just go wherever we want to go. And um, one of the books that I'm writing is in the Pacific Northwest, so I would love to be able to just camp up in the woods, open the door, and just get the inspiration from where we're at. And that's, you know, that's just kind of the goal. Uh, for me, zero, no, nothing. So I am ready for the crash course. <laughs> uh, I've, I've done some, nothing with solar. Um, so this will be new for me, but you know, I've done little things around the house, like switching out a outlet or installing a ceiling fan or you know something like that but never anything um, really in depth and that's part of what we're excited about with the Rego system. It seems like it's really uh, straightforward to actually install but it still is uh, like a robust enough of a system that it can do all the things that we're hoping to do but you don't have to have a degree in engineering to install it right? <laughs> I mean. 